In this video, we are going to set up a monitor in order to detect anomalies in our batch process. In this process, an important parameter is the temperature. We want to avoid high temperatures as they are linked to a bad quality of the product. So we want to be alerted when the temperature in the batch exceeds 52 degrees for more than two minutes. The first step consists in performing the value-based search to find these events where the temperature is too high. So for this, we go to the search menu. We will use here a value-based search and we give here the search criteria. Temperature higher than 52 for at least two minutes. The results list shows the events which happened in the past. We want to set up a monitor which would automatically inform us when a new result is detected. For this, we have to save this search. When you click on save this search, a panel appears on the right side of your screen. Then we can give a name to this search. For example, excessive temperature in the pharma batch. We can give a description, for example, risk of bad quality. We can choose where to save this search in the work organizer, and we can click on save. Once the search is saved, you can configure the monitor in the monitoring menu, which is located at the top right corner of your screen. In the monitoring menu, we can enable a new monitor by clicking on Enable Monitor. Here we can choose the search or the fingerprint we want to base our monitor on and select the search in the work organizer. There we can configure uh, the possible actions linked to the monitor. We can send an email message so here we have to input the email address of the recipient. We can also add a subject and a message. We can also create context items on the new results and call a webhook. When we have chosen these parameters, we can then enable the monitor. Now, in the monitoring overview, we see a table containing all our active monitors. We can click on a monitor to display the result. For the moment, this new monitor has no results yet. When the monitor has detected a new result, this will be indicated with a little number on top of the monitoring menu. Also, the number of unseen results is displayed in the table. You can then click on the name of the monitor to display the monitoring results. There you will see the start date, the end date, and the duration of the detected event. You can also display the trends of the event in Trend Hub by clicking on this button. You can also create a context item manually on this event. To show the trends in Trend Hub, you can simply click here and you switch to the focus chart with this event. If a monitor is not useful anymore, you can go to the monitoring menu and disable the monitor. For this, click on the three dots next to the monitor name and then on disable monitor.